Hello, hello, welcome back. My name is Robert Farmelow. I'm the narrator for the God Consciousness Project. And we're reading directly from the book, God Consciousness, written by God. Oh, there's that little box showing up on your screen. Click on that box and you'll get taken directly to the website. And you can order the book and get it at no cost, no charge. It's free. And you can also buy the book, too, if you want to. Okay, let's get started. Here's Chapter 35, Shame and Guilt, The Dynamic Duo, Part 6. I know that some of you are okay with it as an idea, but only as an idea. On an intellectual level, some of you are very okay with it but not as an actual, factual, dynamic, true experience. That is why you are here, reading this book, listening to this book, this far into the book, and still you haven't hung up on me. You still want to know more about all this. You are still curious enough to hang in there with me. Maybe I'll say something that will really, really make the connection for you or so you might be hoping. There will be some idea that will jump off the page or into your ear that will finally make the bridge between us finally happen. Well, ideas are great, and they certainly help to prepare the ground for the planting of the seed, but it is in the asking that the real reaching me happens. You are asking yourself to open to yourself. You are asking me to communicate with you. It is in this asking that I will answer you, that I will respond to your request, because I have no choice in the matter. It is my free will's will to help you and to respond to you when you ask me to. I am you, and you are me. You are not guilt and shame. That is for sure. You may have performed some actions, thought, some thoughts, felt some feelings that you are feeling, thinking, guilty about, and feeling and thinking ashamed about. But those feelings and thoughts are a way into me, and that is a way into you, and that is the truth. They are a way to get on track, to get into line with who you really, really are and where you really, really want and need to go and what you really, really want to be, to do, to feel, and to think. Have you noticed how strange it is when I put shame and guilt in the context of thinking? You are more used to to the idea of feeling ashamed and feeling guilty about something. Yes, it is true that you sometimes think you might be guilty about something, but rarely do you ever, if ever, think that you are ashamed about something. I hope you see the distinction I'm making. So perhaps now is the time to get into this distinction between thoughts and feelings the strength and integrity of your choice. Okay, that ends this part of Chapter 35 from the book God Consciousness. And you'll notice right now the box has appeared on your screen, and you can click on it. It'll take you directly to the God Consciousness website and you can get the book. You can order it, you can buy it, or you can get it for free. And I mention this consistently. And it is that on the website you're going to find some high value material that you can use and it's free. It's there for you. Click on the box. Check out the website, get the book, read the book. Very powerful information. 
Okay, that's it for now. See you next time. Come on back. We got another heaping helping waiting for you. Bye for now.